also watch till the end for bloopers. Meh. but I'm so excited to take you through my morning routine today. Since it sometimes gets cold in the morning, the first thing I like to do is put on my robe and slippers so I'm all cozy for the morning. Now I'm gonna head to the bathroom to wash my face. washing my face I like to just take about 15 minutes to meditate every morning and I feel like this just really prepares me for the day keeps me calm and productive so I've just set a timer on my phone for 15 minutes and now I'm just gonna close my eyes and relax and that's my alarm so I just take a few more deep breaths and now I'm gonna go downstairs to eat breakfast. I like to have a scrambled egg cooked just like this, some sourdough toast with butter, some sliced apples, and of course, my coffee. After breakfast, I like to do my makeup, but pretend I'm on one of those Vogue Beauty Secrets videos. Hey, it's Chelsea, and today I'm going to be walking you through my skincare routine and all my beauty secrets. Okay, so I've already washed my face and the first thing I like to do is go in with this Laneige Water Bank Moisturizer. I'm almost running out, but I really love it. It really hydrates my skin in the morning. Next, I like going in with this Lotus Youth Preserve Eye Cream. I feel like when I don't get enough sleep the night before, uh, my eyes just get really dark and puffy, so I feel like this just really helps with that. And yeah, it's super thick and creamy. Now, it has just occurred to me, I was sitting in a dark bathroom this entire time. I didn't think to turn on the lights, but I mean, yeah, I'm new here, this is a hotel. So I just turned on the lights, so that should be better. Okay, and that really was the end of my skincare routine. I keep it pretty minimal. And now I'm gonna go into my makeup routine. Like I said, I like to keep it really natural and go for that healthy, fluffy look so I don't do anything on my skin like foundation, concealer and stuff. I just go straight into stuff like blush. So that's what I'm gonna do now. This is the blush compact I currently use. It just has everything I need, so I love it. So I'm just gonna use a fluffy brush to dip into that and put it on my cheeks. And for the highlighter, I'm gonna do the same thing. Just putting it at the top of my cheekbones though. And then the inner corners of my eye. And yeah, that looks great. Now, the last step for me is just gonna be the lips. So I'm going to use this red color. And I know it's not the most natural color for me. But I just like that it gives a little pop to my look. I'm not really sure what outfit I'm going to wear yet, but hopefully this goes with it. Next, I'm going to go in with some mascara. And I feel like this completely transforms my face. It's my favorite part. I honestly don't remember what I looked like before I wore mascara. It's kind of crazy. 
but I feel like I just look so much more awake. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's all I'm gonna do today. So I hope you can see the difference. I definitely feel the difference. And um, I was told to say something inspirational at the end of this. So um, no matter who you are and what you look like, you deserve to have a routine that you love and that just makes you feel good. So I hope this maybe inspired you to be like me or I don't know, but thank you both for inviting me. It was so much fun, bye. Okay, now it is finally time for me to pick out my outfit. So let's head to my closet. And I'll be honest, I can sometimes take a really long time to figure out what to wear. The longest I ever took, I think, was like 3 hours and 13 minutes. I, I almost submitted it to Guinness Book of World Records, but I forgot. But yeah, so um, this might take a little bit, so let me just start trying on some outfits. Okay, this one isn't bad. It's very cozy, but I kind of wanted something that'll pull me together a little bit more. Okay, this is very panda boss, but it's a little bit too much for today, I think. Okay, now this one is super cute, loving the watermelon, but my gut is just telling me this is not the right one. This one is kind of cute too, but oh, it is just so poofy. I feel like I'm getting kind of claustrophobic in this. Okay, this one, I don't know why I ever bought this. I mean, there's just no place where this would be the appropriate thing to wear. Okay, now this one I really like. It's super simple and summery, but also classic. I think I'm gonna go with this one. Also, I forgot to mention, I'll have all the outfits I tried on linked down below so you can get them. And comment below what outfit you liked the most. Okay, I'm actually gonna be heading outside soon, so I'm gonna grab my sandals. Now, the last thing I like to do in my morning routine is spend some time outside and write in my little journal. I just feel like it really clears my mind for the day, and I like to just express my gratitude for what I'm feeling that day. So let's go! pretty warm out there so I'm back inside now and that is pretty much it for my daily morning routine. I really hope you like this vlog and maybe are inspired by it and if you want to see more of me make sure to follow Lixie Pig on Instagram and subscribe to this channel. Also comment below what other kinds of videos and lifestyle content you want to see from me. I love you all so much and I'll shall see you later! Did you like that new catchphrase I said at the end? I just came up with it. I feel like it should be what I say at the end of every video. Oh, oh hey guys. Um, I guess this is my morning routine. use my bar my dad's headband to push my hair out of the way. Real quick before we start, I just want to clip my bangs back real quick. Mm -hmm. I'm just kidding. I don't have bangs. I don't need these. It just has everything I need, so I love it. Oh, uh. oh I'm sorry, Sam. So, um, I've actually been pretty my entire life. And, I mean, it wasn't easy, but someone had to do it, you know? 